Greetings to the viewers. In this video, I would like to present the blue pill based oscilloscope with ADC overclocked. Specification and features. This will be discussed in details further in the video. The oscilloscope controls consist of three buttons and three potentiometers. Figures on the top of display show values of uh, input signal frequency, input signal pulse width, time scale, battery voltage, and some extra information. Demonstration on the uh, channel 1. Frequency change, pulse width, external generator frequency change, so tooth form. Time scale change, time scale fine tuning, formatted line, raw view. We, at the moment, we are plotting data in raw data as seen by ADC. It is formatted line. The raw data is format formatted with Bresenham's algorithm. Triangle waveform, raw view, raw data plotting, formatted line. Square wave form time scale changing the red square around the uh, figures shows the mode we are in at the moment. Changing frequency. Changing pulse width, or we can tell uh, the duty cycle. All this changing is done at the uh, external frequency generator. Two channels demonstration. Channel 1 yellow and channel 2 blue. Channel 2 is fed via differential filter as seen as a picture on the top right. Row view, formatted line, you can change polarity, 
unipolar signal showing only positive part bipolar signal showing both negative and positive now channel 1 we can do zero line shift as they call it so we can change position of the graph in vertical scale channel 2 shifting changing time scale for different view fine tuning of the time scale uh, now it's the similar demonstration but in this demo the uh, channel 2 is fed via integral, integral filter or integral circuit as shown in the bottom right picture again raw data plotting formatted line Unipolar signal key idea was to achieve as big sample rate as possible and see how it works uh, in overclocking, overclocking mode this time we fed the channel 2 through oscillating circuit or filter Passing through this filter, it generates decaying oscillations. Uh, changing, uh, fine tuning time scale. Changing frequency. raw data plotting again formatted line now uh, as seen by the picture at the top right position we are testing the internal frequency generator output of the generator is connected to the input of channel 1 we are working in unipolar, unipolar mode 
So Z frequency is around to left. So it's 90 kHz frequency and uh, we are working in the single channel mode. So we are going to r raise frequency as high as possible which is 200 kHz for this generator. The ADC is working at maximum sample rate. It's around 5 MHz, 5, uh, 5 MHz samples per second. So it should be around 30 Hz minimum. Yeah, 30 Hz. Oh, it's box view. General design, I call it cheap and dirty. Demonstration with a sine wave. We will see how 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 big frequency we can put from the generator probably 100 kilohertz fine tuning of time scale two channel mode but signals going through channel one only Lowering, lowering frequency. One hundred fifty. Now going down to twelve hertz. Well, now we will see the uh, PCB top view and the TFT display which have been used in the project S structure diagram gives general idea how how the uh, system was built so generally speaking this project shows that uh, Blue Pills ADC works satisfactory with overclocking. That's all for today, folks. Thank you.